cloud. Yeah. And it's everyone. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. we've like, you know, Curry Governor, we've got obviously, Matt's picking up cloud, oh, Pelly Penguin oh. is picking up cloud, Trundle thinking about picking up, like, the, it's endless the amount of people who want to play this character. I mean, cloud is kind of a universal character, but we are going to come off the cloud for now, and we're going to be seeing Kazuya Mishima Fantastic. And on the stage here. This makes a lot more sense, doesn't it, that vessel? It does. Matchup wise. Uh, uh, ma Matchup wise, I'm glad you say that because as we're seeing right now, Kazuya is just able to just essentially use Bowser as a big, big turtle shell to punching bag. And we see that happening now. Jork's already at over 100%. Zero to Duncan. death from Matt! What was that, man? Ooh, I mean, to be honest, that is some classic Kazuya stuff, but the sniping, that's not seen very often. But That was a fantastic little mix oh, up, you know? Yeah, a little absolutely. bit of a cherry on top of the pie there. But very slowly but surely, we do see Jorks coming back a little bit, uh, sending Matt off stage now at a high percentage of his own. Gets the gr gets the grab side beat, now sending him back off stage. Ooh, and but a fantastic jump read from yep. Jorks there, equalizing almost immediately. Yep. So far, this has been an absolute tear back and forth from both. Yeah, this is certainly going to be a bloodbath there, Vassal. And hey, it goes both ways, right? Because both of these characters, right? If you're Kazuya. You're labbing combos at 3 a.m. against Donkey Kong anyway, so you're used to just beating up these big boy hitboxes. Oh, definitely. But name me one player who hasn't played against a Kazuya, <laughs> like, consistently. They Honestly, are so common. Yeah, yeah. Uh, at this point, you'd be lucky if you haven't. There are there are a lot, a lot of Kazuyas these days, and honestly, fair, he's a pretty fun character to watch. Yeah, as agreed. He's very... Very explosive, but Ooh. as we say explosive, Matt is going to explode off to the top blast zone. Yeah, and now, the armor. The and armor now there, just so. a wall of fire tearing down Matt's shield. Yeah, doing a lot of work. And it just goes to show kind of the micro power that Jorks is exhibiting right here. That B reverse flame gave him the speed he needed to catch Matt slipping in that shield. And from what looked like an impossible task, Jorks now in the lead battle. That, that is a little surprise indeed, but now. Fundamentally, we are back up to even percents, uh, uh, though Matt on ledge misses the up out of shield, and we're going to see if Matt can get something out of it, but just gets slapped in the face for that. You got that right. I'm liking Jorks' mix-up options, you know, catching Matt's recoveries. It just seems like he does. He isn't quite as confident with all of them, right? He's got the jump reads on luck, as we see there, but some of the harder reads, I don't think we've seen quite as much Ooh. from as that roll read is actually pretty perfect, and now he's looking like a force! Oh, which is just, just gets straight up grabbed out of the up smash. Yeah, that heaven's door yeah. is no joke. He is removing your ability to play neutral, buddy. Can we get a grab right here? Nope, and up tilt instead. Ooh. Almost caught him slipping on the DI. Almost, almost. He almost died off that, but he's just going to live to see another day. Oh, that platform a little bit too high for the up smash there. Unfortunate for Matt as we're getting pretty, pretty close. But a Bowser could side could it. do it. You've got to snap your it. control uh -huh. stick in half to DI that yeah. one. <laughs> that that is the move lasts a long time but somehow still it's still a little tricky to di at least on my end i still haven't figured out how to do it it's very so, yeah it's very rough that's right yeah, we'll, we'll jump on quick play 3 a.m tonight we'll find oh, someone yeah, yeah, who will test sure. us we'll, we'll, we'll find one bowser player there it's fine there that's right in across. the dregs yeah you know but no fair play to jorks looking like an absolute wall on the ends of these stages right here matt has got to find a way to mix up his recovery and maybe even just slow it down a little bit, wait at edge a little bit more, even go high. You know, Tarek is a Kazuya we've been seeing a lot of recently who is really, really good at mixing up his recovery, something that Kazuya himself does struggle with a lot. You're you're absolutely right about that, but right off, beginning this met, this next match, Mac already finding a little Kazuya combo of his own and already has Jorks up to 76%, though Jorks answers with an up out of shield and just tries pressing his shield more, but there's the electric wind god fist out of shield. And oh. Almost got it there. And I like That's what Matt tricky. is doing now. He's slowing it down. So what Matt is expecting is Jorks to mash. You saw it there. Matt air dodged into the ground and immediately spot dodged because he thought there was going to be an upbeat out of shield. But it's a little bit off the timing. He's just smacking Jorks, waiting for him to react, and then punishing him as we see there as he sends him off for a very early stock for the second time round. Oh, absolutely, but based off what we saw from the last game, we could see a quick retort from Jorks come out right at the last minute here, but I'm not sure. Jorks already had a fairly high percent on the second stock of his, while Matt's still at 50. 
not even crossing the 60% threshold. He got that right. Gives up the stage control, which could be curtains for him, but he's still the one in the lead now as the up smash is a little bit too greedy from our buddy Jorks. About to smash. Tries to get, in, Matt tries to get a little combo here, but a, uh, just a little miss input. To be fair, with Kazuya, it is <laughs> tricky to input the electric every time, but Matt still on a tear in this. In How did he too. get away with that oh. fabulous mix-up from Matt? They're not going to work twice, but you don't need it to, Basil. He's, he's already in the lead. Uh, just one combo is all he needs. This could be it. Let's see what he can there. do. Smash down, run down. forward. Oh, Ooh, you don't throw. see that every day, Basil. George just somehow managing to get out of the combo with the shield. Up throw into Forder. Classic from Bowser. The parry into the side B and. That's not going to take it quite yet, sending a laser right up, but just barely misses him. Yeah, so so close. Matt's just got to keep his cool. He's got nothing but time. The aerial's a bit laggy. The falling there is a bit aggy. Going to see if he can pull it out. Spot dodge not quite punished. Up special gives a bit of space for free. And now we're looking at the wall of Jorks, Basil. Absolutely, but Matt is going to just send him off stage with up through a laser and then just normal laser. And it's gonna, it's gonna win the set for him. I'll tell you what. I don't know. Is Matt play a lot of CS:GO? The snipes coming out from this fella today are yeah. absolutely inhuman. <laughs> and that, that was, that, that was insane. Just he was essentially, essentially close to the bow, right? And just manages just pew, and he gets him. <laughs> yeah. Just a pew is all it takes. And I think the first like. This is going to be very stressful. The first eight seconds of this match are what could have decided. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> because I, every time Matt has found a ludicrous string and just ran away with it. Uh, I, I could not agree with you more. I could not agree with you more there, my friend. But we are going to get right into the last game of this uh, three-game set. And just, just, you know, sometimes after getting absolutely exploded by Kazuya Mishima, you got to play a little more patient sometimes. Yeah. Play out, out just outside his threat bubble, but still being able to pressure him. But it's not going to be enough. Or will it? Let's find out. What do you reckon, Basil? Who takes this? Can Matt pull it all the way? Or is Jorks just going to shake off the dust? What do you think? Knowing the nature of, of both characters we have on screen, either one of them could explode the other at any moment. You got that right, jumping over the flame breath. But finding a lot of these down air mix-ups is exactly what you need right now. Going to send him onto the platform. Oh, didn't quite wait out the tech roll, though. Man, just completely avoids the hitbox of the downer with the electric wind gun. It's, it's it's Ooh, heaven's how, door. how that move behaves. And so this one just eats right through his shield and just, you know, go away. Die. It's going to send him back off stage. Jorks on a very clean, brand new stock here. Matt still at 117. Oh. But the, the Kazuya combos might come out just now. So we like to see. And that laser does so much shield damage. It's crazy with the drift as well. Forces him onto the platform. Oh, air dodge into the stage is the speed you need. But Jorks just says no. Very good stuff. The stocks are back to even, but the percents are not. But but as my very friend OK said uh, once, you know, sometimes percent does not necessarily matter. It's more about making sure you have the stock lead, because in this game, you can just stack up a very, very easy percent lead. Absolutely. And Kazuya is going to be the one to do it. He's a character who can come back from any angle whatsoever. Going to see if... Matt can pull it all the way now as clips the right. tail. Oh. Sorry, Mewtwo. How many combos is that? You you cannot shield the last hit of the 10 hit combo. That's not not a very good move, but you know, just manages to just, just chip right through his shield there. Exactly. For those of you who don't know, by the way, if you want to get rid of Rage Drive, you have to take 39% or miss six grabs. I think I know which one we're going to see first, as Matt gets another one of those. He's just, he's just been able to get those very consistently. That's yeah, he's impressive. still got the Rage Drive to go. He's got that Heaven's Door finally running out now. Has taken a lot of damage, but he's got another comeback mechanic, Basil, and it's called Rage. Absolutely, he's still at... Oh, this... Oh, oh wait, that was just praying for him to just get into a tech situation on the platform but just barely misses it and is able to escape but still the stock difference is now none we are back to the last stock of the game yeah looks like matt just needs one hard read to finish it but is jorks going to give it to him basil that's what i want to know as the laser comes out once again and it's an offstage scenario absolutely just hopefully with one laser breath but fire breath i mean but that is going to be it he's been getting those so so much in this set it's it's crazy it is saying. 
very, very crazy. Fantastic stuff from Matt there. Ended from Kazuya's leg, outspacing those big, meaty claws of Bowser. And uh, tell you what, I couldn't think of a better way to spend 5.99. Very nice. My drink appears to have been finished by me. I might need, oh, to, no. get, I might need to get another one soon. Yeah, I, I used my token that. already.